What is up guys, it's your boy Madlow for Lepe Tsefuwa is your pack again with another video on this one. I got you some Don Toliva. Toa, 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 toa. We're gonna be breaking down that one, guys. Let us listen to this thing without wasting any time, boys. You are finally listening to me on the camera. <laughs> Let's listen to this thing without wasting any time. Let's go. If you believe in yourself, it will get you through it. I believe in myself. Can you see what I'm doing? Yeah, it's always a wise and a factor. Shady got me like it. I be standing on some inches, some white ones. Get a drone, I think I'm too fly. Go on, go on, go on, go on, go on. And that's the Don't Only Ever Toa vocal template, guys. Let me break down everything. Let us get into FL Studio. I feel like we should play the vocals one more time without the beat. Let's get it. If you believe in yourself, it will get you through it. I believe in myself. Can you see what I'm doing? Yeah, it's always a wise and a pattern. Shady got me like right too high. I've been standing on some inches, some white ones. Get a drone, I think I'm too fly. Toa, 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 toa. Without wasting any time, um, let me just bypass everything. We're gonna start by explaining the recording chain first. You see, so this is the recording chain, guys. Uh, let me turn this one on. <coughs> yeah, yeah. So, so, uh, yeah, yeah, uh, 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 yeah. So I'm sure you heard the recording chain, guys. Uh, for this track, I'm using a B major. Yeah, that's the key and the scale of the toe up track. Uh, just utilize the Chup Tech CL1B just to emulate their recording chain and some parametric EQ uh pre-1973 visual mix red just emulating the sony c800 and also adding this fg67 just to get some warmth yes uh, that's the recording chain guys i'm gonna leave the link down below to this template now let us move to the source yeah the toe up chain so i'm gonna just keep this thing around here Yes, uh, the first thing I went for is the EQ. On the EQ, I just wanted to roll off the low end and control some frequencies that were bothering me around here on the low mids and the bass. I uh, controlled some presence here a little bit just to dip them down. Then I boosted the highs. I controlled the highs here just to make sure I'm safe before I move further with the chain. That's the aim of this EQ. Let us listen to that. If you believe in yourself, it will get you through it. Then I went for the studio rack. On my studio rack, I'm using a lot of processing. Yeah, I started with the vitamin. On the vitamin, I just wanted to introduce some harmonic distortion, especially on the top end. I just boosted this 66 dB. Then I boosted this knob 3 dB. Let us listen to that. If you believe in yourself, it will get you through it. I believe in myself. Just a little bit, just a little bit of that touch. Then I got the NS1, just removing some background noise. 10. Then uh, I went for the R box. On the R box, I just wanted to glue these vocals together and neutralize the gate just to remove some background noise. Nothing huge. Then I went for the NLS channel. On the NLS channel, I used the Nevo 12 foot lock. 6 db just introducing that saturation on the high mids and uh highs 
Yes, sir. Let us listen to that. If you believe in yourself, it will get you through it. Then I went for the C4. This is just a default preset, but I customized it uh, for controlling the low low end. This thing was just like this. Then I dip it dipped down like this. Then I messed around with this. Then I also control the asses here just to make sure I'm getting clean top end, not that harsh top end. Yes, sir. You can copy this. If you believe in yourself, it will get you through it. I believe in myself. Then on the studio rack, I went for the DSR just to control the chain as I'll be adding more processing, more plugins, more compression and more exciters and more saturation plugins. I decided to pull up a DSR just to make sure my soldiers are there protecting me. Yes, sir. Then I went for the SSL channel. On the SSL channel, I utilize the legendary compressor. I always use this one. But I'm exaggerating it here. I think it's hitting two knobs, 6 dB here. Then I rolled off the low end on the filters up to 90. Didn't do anything. I boosted 8K, 3. Then I rolled off 139 minus 1. That's the only thing I did. If you believe in yourself, it will get you through it. I believe in myself. Yes, just getting these vocals in your face. I decided to pull up with a SSL comp just to glue my vocals and keep them consistent. If you believe in yourself, it will get you through it. I'm sure you can see the needly. It's, it's moving a little bit, a little bit. I'm not exaggerating this compress. I just want the glue. Yeah. If you believe in yourself, it will get you through it. I believe in myself. I'm sure you can hear the difference. Uh, let me move this thing right here on top. Ah! You see. Right there. Let me also switch off the harmonies. Then I went for a CLA 2A where I'm doing some heavy lifting. Uh, the peak reduction 50. I kept this one on default 50. Then the gain is 46. Let us listen to that. Toa, 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 toa. Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. This compressor is super good. Then I went for the Fruity Multi Band compressor. Yeah, the most underrated plugin, but this plugin is super sick, guys. It's super sick. If you can like practice and like experiment with, with this plugin, you can get a lot of good sounds. Let us listen to that. Toa! Without it. It's a very good plugin. It's a very good plugin. Then I went for the visual mix rack. On my, on my visual mix work, I just wanted to use the classic gate just to make sure I'm removing the background noise. Then I utilize the FG800 just to add some crispy high end emulating the Sony C800. Then I use the FG73 emulating the 1073. The visual drive is on 12 foot lock. I then went for the classic tubes. On the classic tubes, I'm using the FG12. Then my intensity is all the way to 150. Just making sure I'm getting this that warm sound of that mic. Yeah. Let us listen to the visual mix rack. Toa, 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 toa. Yeah, let me play it right here on this part. Without the vision mix work. Super sick. Super sick. That's a good trick. You gotta use maybe three mics or two mics on the visual mix work. Yeah. I started using that that 
that trick i think it was last month then i was surprised i was like yeah i'm definitely gonna use this one on many of my tracks yeah then i got the micro shift you say no don't leave a vocal effects without this plugin yes sir let's listen to that uh -huh. I've been stabbing on some bitches, some white ones. Girl, true. I think I'm too fly. Yeah, just adding that movement and spreading the vocals to the sides. Then I got a basic reverb. Uh, the aim of this this reverb was to get a warm sound. Yeah, nothing huge. Flowers on ones and I'm piped up. Shawty got me like too high. I've been stabbing on some bitches, some white ones. Yeah, I think I'm too fly. Nothing huge, nothing huge, guys. Then I went for the meta flanger. Uh, and I'm using the quarter slide, the mix knob at 10%. Yeah, let's listen to that. Flowers and wines and I piped out. Shady got me like too high. I've been standing on some bitches, some white ones. You see. Then I reach for the studio rack again. On my studio rack, I'm using the NLS channel. On this one, I'm using the spike. The drive is on 6, 12 foot clock, 6 dB. Just getting that sound of the spike, the SSL sound. Yeah. Then I got the DBX 160, and I'm using a preset right here. This preset usually works on melodic rap vocals. So it's going to work on, on this type of vocals. And if your vocals are tracked very well, this is going to work. Yes, sir. Then I got the RDS, I just controlling around 9k. I felt like there's some s -s -s over there. Let me, let me let you guys listen to that. I, I didn't like that. I didn't like that. Then I decided to remove it. Flowers and wines and I piped out. Shawty got me like two. I've been standing on some bitches on my ones. Get what true. I think I'm too fly. Then. I got the parallel split on my parallel split. I'm using the uh, NLS channel. I'm using the mic. The drive is all the way up to 12 dB. Then I got the L1 limiter where I'm just keeping the ceiling at minus one. Then my threshold is minus 12,9. This thing will just control my, my plosives, the pop, those peaks. It will chop those peaks and it will introduce a certain sound. Yeah, let me let you guys listen to the vocals without this thing. Flowers and wines and I piped out. Shawty got me like two. With it. Flowers and wines and I piped out. Shawty got me like two. I've been standing on some bitches on my ones. I think I'm too fly. Toa, 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 toa. L1 limits are at the end of the chain. You can never go wrong with this bad boy. Just chopping those peaks. Making sure I'm protecting your, your, your ears, guys. You see, you see. Let's listen to that. Flowers and wines and I piped out. Shawty got me like two. You yes, see, that's the main vocal chain. Then let us move to the reverb. The reverb is just simple. I'm using a plate reverb. This is just a default preset, guys. You don't even have to copy this. You can just open this plugin. You're going to get this same preset. After that, I'm using the saturation knob just to give my reverb that, that, that saturation and that distortion. I love distortion on my reverbs. Yeah, so, and it kind of gives me a certain sound. So, yeah, let us listen to that. Flowers and wines and I piped out. Shawty got me like two. I've been standing on some bitches on my ones. Get what true. I think I'm too fly. Toa, 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 toa. Then we got a delay bus. I'm using a simple delay on this one too. Uh, just a two-step delay. Yeah. You can copy this. Then I got a doubler too. Uh, I'm using this preset, another double take. Then I'm just spreading my delay to the side. Yes, sir. Let me switch off the beat so you guys can hear this delay bus. Yeah. Flowers and wines and I piped out. Shawty got me like two. I've been standing on some bitches on my ones. 
girl true I think I'm too fly Toa, 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 toa The last thing on this template are the harmonies Let me switch off everything here so these are my harmonies right there. I already consolidated them. So this is the chain of my harmonies. Let me just mute this and reopen this one. Okay. This is the chain of my harmonies. I'm just using the metal flanger, chorus light, mix knob, 30%, micro shift, you can copy this. Then I got the sound codizer, just introducing some crispy on these vocals, on the harmonies. Then just the EQ, controlling the low end and controlling the high end. Lastly, just some reverb, just to give my harmonies some space. Yeah. Then I got these. Yeah, that's that the small voice. So uh just spread it, these vocals to the side like this. Double click, go to this thing here. Then if you shift this to the right, your vocals will be spread to the side. Then I just added some reverb just to keep the hook going and energetic. She back to back Toa, 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 Toa Toa, 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 Toa She back to back though, she in the mall I rip a Texas, she gotta go I bought a Lamborghini but she don't live in my love is out. I'm gonna leave the link of this template down below. Make sure you support the boy.